Okay, let's play an interesting game, which is shifting digits. Okay, let me give you a set of certain numbers. So let's say for example, I give you a three digit number. Okay, and this is the ones place, this is the tens place, this is the hundreds place. Six, three, eight. Right? And okay, let me give you another one over here. And here I'll put four, three, one. Okay? What do you mean by shifting digits? Shifting digits means we have some given number of digits in the given number. Okay? What will happen? if I move one digit from one place keep it to the other so let's say what will happen if I move 6 to the place where 8 is there and move 8 to the place where 6 is there so 3 remains as it is I put in 8 at the place where 6 is there and move 6 and put to the place where 8 is there now tell me is this number 836 greater or lesser than 638? This is 638. This is 836. Which one is greater? Obviously, 836 is greater. Right? Now, let me do the same thing to the second one. Okay? And what I do here is, again, same thing. I move 4 which is at hundreds place to ones place right and what do I get over here move it to the place where 1 is and move 1 which is at ones place to hundreds place here and this poor chap 3 remains as it is now tell me which one is greater is 431 greater or 134 greater obviously 434 1 is greater the sign represents greater which one of the two is greater now can you imagine why has this happened in both the cases what I did was simply I moved the digit which was at hundreds place okay and I swapped it at the place where ones is there and put in the digit which is at ones place to the one at hundreds but why is it that the result is different so the new number formed in case one if I may call this is greater than the given number but in case 2, the new number is smaller than this. The answer is pretty simple. Tell me one thing, is 1 great or bigger number or 100 bigger? 1 bigger or 100 is bigger? Obviously, 100 is bigger. So whenever we make a movement of a digit, what I am doing by moving 8 from 1 to 1's place to the 100's place is, I am increasing the number of hundreds to 8. Right? The digit at the ones place is greater than the digit at the hundreds place. So every time, every time when you move a digit from a place value which is lower, but effectively it's higher. So the place value of ones is lower than 100, but the value of the digit at ones place is more. The number which is formed is always going to be greater. So in this case, 8 is greater than 6. Therefore, the moment I move 8's value from 1's to 100, it becomes 800. Right? So I increase the number of 100's from 6 to 8. And therefore, the resulting number is greater. As against this, if I look at the second case, what am I doing? At my 1's place, I had 1. Okay? And I increased. Increased or decreased? Decreased. So I, what I did was instead of 400s, I made them 100. Why? Because the value of this digit was less than what it was exchanged for. So every time you move a lower digit to a higher place value, if I may put it that way, the value of the resulting number is going to be less. But every time I put in a higher digit to a higher place value, the value increases. Right? And this will always hold true whether it's 110 ones, whether it's 1110 tens, or whatever it is, right? Now try shifting digit with 
this given number 639 okay and you are told move or swap change 3 to 9 and 9 to 3 and get me the result and try the logic that I have told you thank you